What's up guys? Today we are gonna tell you 7 mind-blowing facts about black hole. So let's get started. Number 1. Dying stars creates black hole. Stars generate energy by fusing hydrogen atoms into helium. This process is known as nuclear fusion. Nuclear fusion releases energy. This energy resists the star's own gravitational pull. When the nuclear fusion stops, there is no force to resist gravity. Star's gravitational force compresses the star and it gets smaller and smaller in size. If the star is above a certain mass, it collapses into a black hole. Number 2. Black holes come in a range of sizes. There are at least three types of black holes, NASA says, ranging from relative squeakers to those that dominate a galaxy's center. Primordial black holes are the smallest kinds, and range in size from one atom's size to a mountain's mass. Stellar black holes, the most common type, are up to 20 times more massive than our own sun and are likely sprinkled in the dozens within the Milky Way. And then there are the gargantuan ones in the centers of galaxies, called supermassive black holes. They're each more than one million times more massive than the sun. How these beasts formed is still being examined. Number 3. Black holes will spaghetti to fire you and everything else. Black holes have this incredible ability to literally stretch you into a long spaghetti-like strand. Appropriately, this phenomenon is called spaghettification. If you fell into a black hole, theory has long suggested that gravity would stretch you out like spaghetti, though your death would come before you reached singularity. Number 4. Black holes have three layers. The outer and inner event horizon and the singularity. The event horizon of a black hole is the boundary around the mouth of the black hole where light loses its ability to escape. Once a particle crosses the event horizon, it cannot leave. Gravity is constant across the event horizon. The inner region of a black hole, where its mass lies, is known as its singularity, the single point in space-time where the mass of the black hole is concentrated. Number 5. Black holes slow down time. Time slows down as you reach the event horizon the point of no return. To understand why, think back on the twin experiment that is often used to explain how time and space work together in Einstein's theory of general relativity. One twin stays on Earth while the other one zooms out into space at the speed of light, turns around, and returns home. The twin that traveled through space is significantly younger because the faster you move, the slower time passes for you. As you reach the event horizon, you are moving at such high speeds due to the strong gravitational force from the black hole, that time will slow down. Number 6. Anything can become a black hole, in theory. The only difference between a black hole and our sun is that the center of a black hole is made of extremely dense material, which gives the black hole a strong gravitational field. It's the gravitational field that can trap everything, including light, which is why we can't see black holes. You could theoretically turn anything into a black hole. If you shrunk our sun down to a size of only 6 km across, for example, then you would have compressed all of the mass in our sun down to an incredibly small space, making it extremely dense and also making a black hole. You could apply the same theory to Earth or to your own body. Number 7. Black holes evaporate over time. This surprising discovery was first predicted by Stephen Hawking in 1974. The phenomenon is called Hawking radiation, after the famous physicist. Hawking radiation disperses a black hole's mass into space and over time, and will actually do this until there is nothing left, essentially killing the black hole. 
This is why Hawking radiation is also known as black hole evaporation. That's it for today. Meet you in the next video.